There are eight teams currently competing in the Friars Briar in Lethbridge. Laverne Houts, a pastor from British Columbia, is entering his 11th year participating in the event. The first Friars Briar took place in Winnipeg in 1978. There's curlers from all across Canada. Um, sometimes we have more curlers than the other briar. Uh, I think we've had as many as 20 teams. Uh, so there's lots of participation and there's the camaraderie of getting together every year. Houts says the rules of curling are simple enough to master. There's the, the various concentric circles on the ice and um, the, the team that has their, the closest rock to what's called the button, the smallest circle, they will score a point for that. Or if they've got the two closest rocks, they'll score two points or three or four. The game is consisted of kind of draws and takeouts. So a draw is kind of a soft weight that gets you into the house, into those rings, and a takeout eliminates a rock from the rings. And you just have to do you know one or the other to use your strategy to accomplish uh, getting your rock closest to the button. Chris Schwanz made the trip up to Lethbridge from Wisconsin. He says curling is all about etiquette and having fun. And that is another thing that's kept bringing me back to this too is uh, just the relationships, uh, how welcoming everybody has been up here. Uh, they know me by name even though they only get to see me five days out of the year. It's not until next year that we get back together. But I noticed that coming here to Lethbridge too this time. Just, uh, Chris, Chris, hey, Chris, hey, how's it going? You know, so that, um, that says a lot about the event. The Friars Briar will run until March 11th, where awards will be given out to the winners. For Bridge City News, I'm Micah Quinn.